Hey, 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 welcome in, Cakers. It is time to vote for some Team Wars stuff. Looks like this week we are going to be doing fantasy sci-fi. And we've got a few neat little cards to choose from down here. Let me see, we have got... We're going to start right here, we're going to go with Awesome-O. Um, we're definitely picking the alien drone over Garrison there. Don't forget to bring your towel. And we see we have cock magic down there. We're going with rats because we've got cock magic. Cock magic is crazy good. Uh, we're going to vote Mecha Timmy here over the Belf. I'm going to go with Transmorgification over the Poison. We'll choose Hyperdrive. And let's see what we got here. It looks like we are down to Assassins. We've got Randy or Kale. Randy or Kale and some Assassins. Looks like we've got some Shooters down here on the bottom. Labar Jimmy. Sometimes he's my only friend. Bar Jimmy might do very much more better here than the Terrence and Philip, but both at the same cost. We're going to go with Terrence and Philip. Uh, I'd prefer the Ice Sniper Wendy over the Mephesto here, but um, everybody's going to have a low leveled Ice Sniper Wendy. I don't like that both of my ranged units will be flyers and will be flying forward heavy. Uh, you got to pick Kale for the boosts, for the heals, but I'd love to see Randy out there. And of course, if we go hanky here, our circles are going to be that much mo better. Looks like Canadian Knight Ike could benefit from that. Looks like uh, Kenny could benefit from that. One thing I'm going to tell you, you're going to have to be worried about this week is an out of control Ike. Now he's not got the health increase buff here from the uh, Robin Twerk, but he does have that hanky with him giving you circles. So don't let your Ike get out of control if you've got Ike against you. We're going to go with the Cyborg Keeney here though. Uh, I'm not really a big fan of mind control overall. It seems pretty worthless in the game to me. It doesn't last for long enough, and with somebody like Cyborg Keeney, you just wind up healing a unit and having them turn around to start their mind control epic adventures. And if uh, they aren't finished off, or if they don't get whatever job it is done that you wanted done, those units turn right back around and start beating you up again after mind control wears off. Uh, four costs there. I think we're going to go with the Cyborg Keeney anyhow. Um, so, Cakers, it looks like up and down this list, I've got one more choice to make. I've got to pick Butters, or we've got to go with the Hanky. Hanky is absolutely going to help our Awesomeo, our Mecha Timmy, and that's it for what we're going to wind up choosing. So we're going to go with Paladin Butters, definitely for the energy advantage and for that epic shield so let me see here the idea here is to start with your start out with your awesome o be low and slow if you can um if you're a cock magic artist you know work that cock magic in there and play it against your own alien drone if you need to alien drone is not susceptible to cock magic but uh this looks like a typical sci-fi setup deck here uh stick awesome o out there get your mecha timmy rolling Knock down units, use those uh, rats to fend off mind control, uh, use those rats to fend off cock magic, and just get up there on that new kid with those range units, get them boosted with the kale, use that hyperdrive on that last bar if you really need it. Cakers, this deck looks like it could be a fun deck and it's not super costly. Um, get out there, build you something fun, have you some fun this week. It looks like Team Wars is going to be another 
fun, epic set of battles. Much love, much cake to each and every one of you out there. Hope you don't forget to bring your towel when you come back on that flip side. Would we'll definitely do that powwow. And until that time, Rusty Whore will always tell you peace, 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 peace.